if you're new here, I guess you don't. So I'll introduce myself anyway. Hi, I'm Elena. Nice to meet you. Welcome to my channel. Um, I hope you really enjoy being here. If you do, please hit that red subscribe button so that I know you like to be here and watch my videos. And we can just all be friends, okay? We can all just be friends. Today I have a haul video for you guys. Um, yeah, I know I'm a minimalist and minimalists don't really do hauls. But I do. I, I, I did. Okay, um, I really like plants and all of mine pretty much died. I still have my old cactus. Mm, most of them are just dead. Like this one, this one's like half dead, but it's got a new little baby on there. I don't know if you can see it. Um, so yeah, I'm hopeful for it, but most of them are dead. So I got new ones and they have really just made my bedroom look the way I want it to. And also got a few other bedroom pieces. So yeah, without further ado, let's just get right on into this. So I'm gonna start with my smaller plants and go up as they like gradually get bigger um so first off is this tiny cactus that i got um he was like five dollars and i got all of these at home depot my local home depot but this little baby cactus was about five dollars um yeah it's cute i also got this little aloe plant that came in this cute little wrap thing um it was in the mother's day section but i bought it for myself and I think he was $5. I don't know. It doesn't say. It does not say. So, we're going to say this one was $5. Okay. Next one I have is Pothos. I think that's how you say it. Pothos. Um, it's a green leafy, like, trailing kind of plant kind of turns into like vines that kind of just trail all over the place and it was sitting on my desk um how much was this one? Oh, 11.98 set it right on the front right where i couldn't see but this one was like 12 dollars at home depot it's really cute this is probably my favorite it even came in like this really nice modern looking pot so i didn't have to buy a new pot for it so that made me happy the next plant i have is this zz plant i don't know if you're supposed to say zz or say z i'm gonna say zz plant all right and i got it this i had made a list of plants that i wanted to get and all of the ones that I've already showed you were on the list. This one was not. And there were a few things that were on the list that I couldn't find. So I got this one instead. Um, I got it because it says that it's an easy care plant, which is definitely what I need because I'm really bad with plants. But um, this one was $11 and it's just really cute. It was sitting on my desk and it came in this super cute um, modern pot just like the other one. The next plant I got is a Boston fern. Um, it's really heavy, so if I don't show a good side, then I'm sorry. Um, yeah, Boston fern, it was $11. Um, it says that it's a good house plant and it likes bright light. I had it sitting on that table over there right in front of the window. And it's just really cute. This was also another one. I was not planning on getting, but ferns are nice. And I thought, why not? Okay. The next thing I got was on the list. It is a spider plant. Um, it's really, really cute. It's supposedly an easy care house plant. This is what it looks like. I had it hanging on my hanging shelf that I have a DIY of if you wanna see that. There will be a link in the description. Um, had to buy a new pot for it because the pot it came in was one of those store pots, like just really plastic, um, not very cute ones. But also, you can see the roots hanging out the bottom of them. So I made sure to get a new pot for it on the same day. 
So I got this pot from the dollar store. It was $2. So this one, I don't think I can even pick up to show you. I might just have to scoot it. Can you see it? Not really. Okay. This is the biggest plant that I've got. It's also the most expensive. It was $13 and it is White Bird of Paradise. Um, I had put on my list to get a fiddle leaf fig, but I couldn't find one. But this one looked a lot like them. So I decided to get it. It's a house plant. It likes bright light. Um, so yeah, I thought this was a good buy. It's really cute and yeah, I like it. It's a really good focal point for my bedroom. Okay, so that was the last of the plants that I got. But I did get a few other small things on Saturday. I got this very cute rug. It's like different shades of blue chevron. It goes really well with my tapestry that I got from Earthbound that I will be hanging in my room right after I get painted. I'm trying to take the strings off and unroll it for you guys. It was $5 from my local dollar store. And this is what it looks like. It's really cute. Um, I'm thinking I'll put it in front of my bed or in front of my desk. I don't know which one yet, but it's really, really cute. It looks really good in my bedroom. And also, I got three of these little, what are these called? I don't know what they're called. They're like little plastic plates that you put underneath a plant so that, um, so that it catches the water after you water plant. Um, yeah, it was three for a dollar, so I got three. I might need more, I might not need more. Either way, I can get more if I need more. I just bought that many for now. And I also bought, well, I didn't buy. My mom bought me a lavender bathtub truffle. This is what it looks like. Um, I've never had a bath bomb before, so I asked my mom if I could get one, and she said yes. And it's like, my skin's really sensitive, so I normally wouldn't try something like this. But it says that it's made out of all natural stuff. Um, so I was like, well, if I'm going to try one, then I might as well try one that's made of all natural ingredients. So hopefully that won't affect my skin as bad. And if it does, then whatever. <laughs> I just don't do it again. Okay guys, so that was my minimalist haul video, plant haul video. Um, I hope you really, really liked it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. I would appreciate that so much. Also, comment down below and tell me which plant was your favorite. Mine is the pothos. Um, it's just really cute. And I don't know. I just like it. Um, I will be seeing you guys sometime soon. If you hit the bell beside the subscribe button, then you won't have to wonder when I'm uploading. But I do upload Mondays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. One of the three. This week it's going to be two of the three. Sometimes I might even do three of the three. So you never know. You just, to be safe, you should just hit the little bell button. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.